Hi guys, it's the 14th Prime here, back with another video review. And today we'll be looking at the Lego Bionicle 2015 Protector of Ice. So, here he is. There. The first, take a quick look. The packaging. There's a nice picture of him up there. 6 to 12, 62 pieces. Protector of Ice, he has no little name. Lego Bionicle, thank god it's back. Um, stuff it can do. You can take him and him and make that. Which I kind of don't really like because basically it's just the protective weapons on him. And you just take the mask and make it gold. That's, ba that's basically all it is. I mean, nothing really too major there. But you know, it's not all about the packaging. It's about the figure. But um, yeah, here he is. And go ahead and get this stupid thing out of the way. It's basically going back to brain attack and just like, ugh. But I mean, it does look like a nice, it is a nice little head sculpt. I don't think it's too bad. And these can, like, you can just, like, take off the mask. And you can, you know, plug it in here. Like, I am controlling you, but I don't want to do that. Like I said, brain attack. It sucks. Basically, the articulation on this is eh, 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 eh. That's, that's pretty much it. Then it's blah. Not that's about it. Put that crappy thing on the side. Now we'll get on to the real thing, which, for a quick comparison, just go ahead and get it out of the way. Here he is with Kobaka. He's, uh, the master of ice. He's just a protector. You're nothing. I'm just kidding. Well, he's still a pretty cool figure. He by himself. He by himself. He does have nice detail. And this spins. Like, spinning things should. And here's his little gun thing. I'm not really going to fire it. Basically, it... Shoots out these by this little piece right there. The yellow piece, that little thing. And if you turn it, it just goes pew. But I really don't want to shoot it. And the face mask. I think it's pretty cool. I mean, I know basically all the protectors are the exact same masks, just recolored. But I still think it's cool. And of course, like the other ones, it has this thing pull off. Which basically, was basically, forgot to mention this in the beginning. I'm going to do these reviews as I have... Four sets of the Bionicles. I have the the Master and then the Protector. I have Kopaka, Pohatu, um, Tahu, and Una, I think. I don't know. You gotta read his backs. Her, his or her. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to call it. I don't know what to call it. We'll go with that. We'll go with it. That sounds good. But yeah. <laughs> anyway, articulation, head. Does have a good range of motion, but you want to hold on to this so the mask doesn't come off. Full 360. You can look down. It can look really up. Like, whoa, what's that in the sky? What is, what is that? What is that? Arms can move in and out. 360. The, the really thing that kind of sucks is that this is how long the arms are, and it's just that. I mean, there's nothing really major there. Legs move forward, back, rotating in and out. Bend at the knee and foot pivoting. Face mask is coming off. These reviews are pretty much just going to be really, really quick. The protectors. So yeah, my overall thoughts. I think it's cool. Let me get this little crappy thing in here. I think it's pretty cool of a set. Even on its own, I think it's just still pretty dang cool. I mean, I'm, I'm very happy to see Bionicle back. Five years ago, 2010, it was discontinued. And the funny thing is, this lasted for about ten years, then discontinued. But here, in fact, it lasted about five years, then discontinued. Which is kind of ironic if you really think about it. Since Hero Factory lasted like half as long as Bionicle. Until they were finally like, yep, ran out of ideas, let's go with this. That's kind of what happened. So yeah, overall thoughts. Love it, think it's cool. Give it like, I don't know. Probably an 8.6. Oh, not 8.6, like 8.3. I mean, I do still really like these sets. And I'm not really sure if I do want to give it a rating. Just because, I mean, I can't really totally judge these. Because if it's one protector, it's going to be the exact same for the rest. Because most of them are the exact same build. Not the exact same build, but they're basically similar. Like, you know, this one's similar. And, uh, and this one's similar. Articulation-wise, they're pretty much similar. And practically the exact same. And basically, these are sadly what everyone feared. It's, um, Hero Factory with a new name and new face practically what it is but nonetheless it's cool it's nice i think it's very very neat but anyway i think that's what all i have to say so 
Be sure to check out my channel for more video reviews, and please don't forget to subscribe. Also, check out Megatronus 186, link in the description below. And this is the 14th Prime, signing out.